Hey guys, how's it going? So this is a little update on Shiba Inu, and this is not like my this is not my information, and there's no actual information on on this. But according to some people who do a lot of research on Shiba Inu, that Robinhood is actually buying Shiba Inu right now, and um. So well, that's what's caught, what that's a major reason why Shiba Inu is going up massively. So basically, um, Robinhood is planning to launch Shiba Inu on their platform, and they are buying a ton of coins, like millions and million dollars of worth of coins for their reserve currency. So when in like I don't know when, maybe in a couple weeks, maybe in a month, they're going to be launched on their platform, and it makes a lot of sense why they would launch it on their platform because Robinhood is a uh, heavily based on retail investing, and when retail investors see Shiba Inu launch on their platform, a lot of people are going to be buying it because it looks so cheap, like. Sitting at zero point zero 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 three two two three cents, right? The Robin Hood crowd is going to be is going to eat that up because because of the the price they can buy hundreds of millions of shares with thousands or uh, tens of thousands of dollars, and it's, you know, so it's just that feeling of owning a lot of Shiba Inu. It uh, makes them happy. You know, I'm gonna be a millionaire. I don't allow Shiba in you. <laughs> That's probably the reason why they're go they're going to put it on their platform. And another reason why I think they do they're gonna do it is because if we look down here, I didn't realize this, but Coinbase owns Shiba in you, Binance owns Shiba in you, Crypto.com owns Shiba in you, uh. Voyager own Shiba Inu. A lot of major exchange platforms own Shiba Inu. So I'm just I I can I can only imagine that uh, Robinhood wants some of this action, and the they're the reason why the uh Shiba Inu is going up because they're buying a ton of them for their platform when they launch it. Week maybe two weeks maybe three weeks. I don't know when, but I think eventually Shiba will come on the Robinhood platform. And uh, that's a major reason why Shiba is going to you know, break all-time highs. I think Shiba is going to break this 52-week high of uh, 0.35 cents. I don't know when, but I think it will, and I think it's going to go a lot higher. It's very very exciting. Very happy I bought some. Wish I I wish I loaded the boat on this. I wish it was my top currency that I bought, but it's not my top currency. Oh well, whatever. Uh, but uh, you know, maybe I, I wish I bought like I started buying some as soon as it popped. As soon as I made that video about Elon Musk pumping Shiba, so I just kept loading the boat on this, but late now uh but if if it, if it had a major pullback I, I might consider buying some so we'll see what happens moving forward uh shiba inu up 385 sorry uh here shiba inu up 385 cent in one week and becomes the 12 largest cryptocurrency when i first bought this cryptocurrency you know what some people came to me and said shiba inu is a scam stay away from it <laughs> well this scam made me a lot of money so so much for it being a scam scam right that's what some people were calling it a scam so but the scam is uh, up 385% in one week. Less than one week. So, great scam. Scam just made me a lot of money. So, we'll see what happens moving forward. But I'm very excited because 
Oh, you know, who wouldn't be excited? Who wouldn't be excited being in Shiba Inu right now? Who wouldn't be happy right now? You're making a lot of money, especially if you bought it down here, and you bought it down here, and then it just skyrockets on you. Does it matter when you bought it? Cause if you bought it at the top or you bought it at the bottom, but well, the lower the better. But does it matter? You still made like three hundred percent plus in like a short amount of time. So yeah. Uh, the market today is green, super green. Uh, gold is uh, I don't know, slightly green. Oil is down a little bit, but the market is really bright and green this morning. Uh, Lordstown is Lordstown crash over? Is it going to start a rally now? Who really knows at the end of the day? Uh, but uh, you know, it, the red has stopped and the green has come. Maybe it's time to pick up some shares. I have no idea. Not financial advice. Just that on out. Voyager Digital. Voyager Digital up 0.72 cents today. Up 5.82%. Jeremy came out last night. Made a video about it. And uh, some of his retail army started to buy it up. And the stock is green today. But like I said, retail don't move stocks. It's the big money, so we'll see where that goes, where that will move. But uh, I also believe that there's a lot of day traders that are looking at Jeremy's videos and buying it, and day traders have no authority to a stock. They're going to buy in, going to go up five, six percent, or ten percent. They're going to sell and take some profit, and then that's going to create some volatility on the low side. So we'll see what where that goes. And I believe that we, uh, the day traders, the traders who are more likely to move a stock than the retail investors that are the long term holders. They don't move stocks, they just buy and hold and you know, hope the market pumps it. <laughs> uh, so we'll see what happens, we'll see where this goes. Anyways, that's it for the video. I don't really have too much to say. Oh, wow, I only got like. 30 seconds left to go. Uh, Coinbase today is probably up. Coinbase up 1.57%. Definitely, uh, retail investors are not moving Coinbase. I think they just buy and hold. Uh, so. Anyways, that's it for the video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and have a great day. Bye.